is. Praise God. Hallelujah. Thank you, Brother Jonathan, Sister Deb, for them good songs. And I'll tell you what, good, good music, good singing, good anointed singing, praise God. Songs that the Lord has inspired will build us up, give us God's inheritance. And you know what? It will. It will encourage you. Songs that are inspired by the Lord, inspired by the Word of God. Because not all songs are inspired by God. Some, some call them gospel songs, but some of them are full of doubt and unbelief. Don't listen to those songs. Like Sister Deb said, Jesus is coming soon. Like she sung that. She said that. She said what the Word said in First Thessalonians. Jesus is coming soon. And, and that is for sure because he said in his word, the angel standing by when Jesus ascended up, said, just as you see him go, in like manner, he will return. Jesus said, if I go away to prepare a place for you, in John chapter 14, I will return and receive you unto myself that where I am, you may be also. So he is coming. And he does love, love us. And you know what the Bible says? That God wouldn't, that any should perish, but that all should come to repentance. He's give everybody on this earth a chance. Everybody that's ever been born, he's given them a chance. That has come to the age of accountability and, and knows right from wrong. He's tugged at their heart. His spirit has drawn them. And some have accepted him. Some have rejected him. Some have received him to go on and do a mighty work for him. And work with him. And some have rejected him. And some have left this world and went to a devil's hell and are suffering and the Bible says it's an everlasting punishment and in hell you have your same you have your memory you have your faculties you can see and hear and feel and you wouldn't want anybody to go to that awful awful place but Jesus has made a way that we don't have to go there. He's made a way for us that we don't even have to taste death because the Bible said he tasted death for every man. We don't have, even have to taste death. Praise God, we could just be out of our bodies and out of here in a, and listen, and, and when our heart stops right then and right there in a split second and not even taste death. Praise God. Hallelujah. That's good news. Amen. But it comes by receiving him, by what he's done on that cross, by him shedding his blood. Praise God. Receiving him, believing in him, the Lord Jesus Christ. The Bible says, believe on him and you shall be saved. Believe on him. What Jesus has done, believe on him. We, When we believe this is coming right out of the Spirit. When we believe, we believe on Jesus and the things he did. Not only do we believe in him that he did it, we believe on him, on, the, on Jesus and the works that he did. And the Bible says believe on the Lord Jesus Christ. Believe on him and you shall be saved. Praise God. Hallelujah. Amen. I'd like to introduce my husband to come forth, bring the word of God. Get your notepads out. Get your Bible out. Follow right along. And I'll tell you what, God will give you something good. <laughs> 